Hey, what's up? Hello, y'all. It's your girl, Evolve and Goddess. Welcome to my channel, y'all. So if you guys are new for the first time, welcome. If you have been rocking with me, though, you already know what time it is. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. So what's up, Gemini? What's going on with your love life for the month of September, guys, okay? Um, these readings are general. Only take what resonates and don't force it if it's not your story. In addition, guys, the roles can be reversed, okay? So for your start-off song, guys, it was one wish during the pre-shuffle here, okay? So you guys may have a wish, okay? Um, some kind of new beginning. Maybe it's a mother. Maybe it's, you know, something that you are birthing, guys. All right? You guys are wanting something new here, okay? Maybe you're wanting some truth here, okay? Um, because with that mistress, or not the mistress, okay? So first of all, the empress is a Libra, right? Maybe you guys are wanting something new with the Libra. Others of you guys, there could have been some secrets possibly about somebody here, okay? That can represent a mistress sometimes. All right? Death card, though. An ending. Ending and a transformation here. With all endings come new beginnings here. That's why that empress is there, okay? So some of you guys are leaving something, okay? Yeah. Some of you guys are leaving something where there was pain, separation, heartbreak, right? Maybe even third-party situations here, right? Especially with this, you're going to suffer, right? Cry by Kay Michelle here, okay? You made that bed. Now you're going to lay in it here, right? All right, y'all. So let's find out what's going on here. Four of Wands is your overall energy. So this is marriage, ceremonies, house things, right? Maybe this is your partner you live with. Maybe you're not married here. But this is like something built on a solid foundation. Two people here. All right? Maybe planning a wedding, guys. Okay? Um, somebody's fighting. Somebody's fighting for this here. Wanting to kind of overcome any obstacles, any challenges in this connection potentially here. Others of you guys may be leaving, leaving a connection here, maybe because of a lack of commitment, right? Somebody was fighting, it was fighting, I had to fight too many people, I was just always feeling alone here, type of energy, okay? Let's see, what's the focus for you guys? Nine of Swords, okay? For the month of September, your focus, guys, this is all about, maybe, um, guys, this could be a dream, right? Sometimes, you guys, this can be like somebody who was just really thinking about something that they really want here. Maybe it's the commitment, maybe it's your twin flame. Maybe it's marriage, guys, all right? Others of you guys, this is stress. This is worry. Maybe this is depression here, right? This is fear here, okay? Maybe regarding somebody that you live with or somebody there was a deep connection here, right? I want something solid here. I want something for the long term, right? I'm not bitter. Stay with her here, okay? All right, eight of swords, guys, right? This is worry. This is fear. This is, you know, I'm overthinking. I'm thinking about worst case scenario here. It's kind of, it's in my head a little bit here, okay? I'm feeling stuck. I feel like I can't get out of something here. All right, I feel like I can't communicate something here, okay? Three of pentacles, guys. Yeah, some of this was like a third party situation, okay? Too many people were involved here. Um, others of you guys are really, maybe, like I said, I always get planning a wedding for you guys. You guys are planning something. All right, you guys are trying to, you know, I feel like you guys are trying to rebuild, guys. If this is an existing relationship, you guys are maybe trying to rebuild, trying to partner together, trying to work together. Some of you guys, there was a lack of partnership, a lack of commitment here, okay? And you guys are maybe feeling a little bit stuck, right? Like, I can't see myself out of this situation here, okay? Yeah, the moon card. All right, this is something being hidden. This is somebody not being able to kind of see something. This is maybe somebody having some skip, some fears, some insecurities here. Um, the moon card could represent a shadow card here, okay? You guys, with the nine of swords and the moon card, that can seriously be depression, so be careful about that, all right? Um, and it could be because somebody is feeling like they're doing things all on their own, a lack of commitment, a lack of partnership here, okay? Um, others of you guys, this is definitely you guys really trying to kind of plan and work together and partner um, for the future, okay? But somebody's a little bit stressed and worried about something here. There could have been some secrets, guys, some kind of communication. All right, somebody's trying to get some clarity. Somebody's trying not to be confused here. Somebody may be kind of ignoring something or somebody's trying to seek something here, okay? Somebody's not getting along, though. All right. Um, so what's going on? What's in the recent past for you guys? All right. Six of Pentacles, guys, right? 
Um, this is balance, guys. This is, you know, the equal give and take. And for me, guys, I feel like somebody wasn't getting it here, okay? Maybe there were some decisions that were made. Guys, we got the, the Six of Pentacles to me. In the traditional deck, right, somebody's holding a scale, a balance, right? So this is maybe, you know, people are, you know, parting ways here. Lack of partnership, lack of commitment here, all right? Otherwise, guys, this is once again that balance, okay? Yeah, guys, for me, Six and Three, that's Nine of Pentacles, somebody's single, right somebody's just kind of putting in the work on themselves and trying to build themselves up but otherwise this is the th you know people working together right trying to find balance that reciprocity that equal give and take guys now for me guys this is the recent past so people may be kind of making a decision that they want to move forward towards their dreams or people are maybe kind of making a decision that they're kind of turning their back on something some of you guys may be refusing to make a decision right out of fear why is this a here for the recent pass here? Oh, I pledge allegiance to your love, guys. Yeah, this is somebody maybe kind of really making a decision to stay committed here, work together in this partnership. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? I love this song, guys. Thank you. All right, guys. All right, guys, um, seven of swords, guys, all right? So this is unfortunate, okay, because this is deception, all right? Especially with the six of pentacles, right? That's that, you know, that equal give and take. Somebody wasn't getting it here, all right? Now, in addition, guys, somebody could be self-sabotaging here. Whether or not you're staying in something that you kind of are closing your eyes to, right? Or you're just kind of self-sabotaged by always thinking about worst case scenario, right? You're in your head too much, potentially, right? Just can't really... Um, because you can't really see the outcome, you just automatically get, go to worst case scenario potential, guys, all right? Um, but this is not the best combination, guys. The Seven of Swords is all about kind of being strategic. It's about doing things differently this time, guys. We got the Seven, Eight, Nine, okay? So this is kind of working our way up to the Ten of Swords, okay? That could be good. It could be bad, right? Just kind of depends on what end, of the, the, what end of the stick you're on, guys. But for me, I feel like there's really a need to kind of make sure that you're balanced here, okay? Think about something and seeing something clearly here for what it is, all right? For some of you guys, this is a valid partnership. It's about doing things differently here and not self-sabotaging, okay? Doing the equal give and take in the partnership, guys, okay? Working on the partnership together, Maybe kind of communicating, guys. This is beautiful. I love this song. All right, so what is it that you guys want, Gemini? All right, you guys just want some support. All right, you want to get out of the financial struggle. You want to be held here, okay? You want to go out of the cold days. You want to be able to express. You want to be able to talk, all right? You don't want to be all pinned up here, okay? You guys want that Six of Pentacles here, right? I want the balance. I want the support. I want the happily ever after here, okay? I just want to feel free. I feel like some of you guys want to just like open up here. The Five of Pentacles for me is all about like a shift in perspective. It's about like a lack of faith a little bit, guys. So it's like you guys just want to have something committed, something for the long term here, okay? You guys want to hold on to something. I feel like you guys want somebody to maybe hold you or you guys want to hold somebody potentially, okay? Yeah, some of you guys... Um, you guys just want to look to better days here, okay? You guys, this song, K. Michelle, guys, right? This is sad, okay? So this is, you know, love them all, guys. This is, you know, some of you guys want that unconditional love here, right? I just want you to love me with everything you got. Others of you guys, you guys are just really feeling hurt and betrayed by something, okay? So what is the challenge and what is it that you guys fear? The emperor, okay? Um... Okay, so for some of you guys, this has have something to do with the family where maybe you are feeling like you're kind of feeling a little bit left out here. Okay, father figure, older figure, um, just somebody who is a divine masculine, right? You could have a long, a long term commitment with this per this person potentially here. Okay, now the challenge, guys, is standing your ground here. All right, being confident, listening to your intuition, guys. It's about kind of really stepping into that position of power, guys. Okay. Others of you guys are fearing that you're not going to have maybe the support from somebody here. Oh, I feel like child support. 
You're not going to have support maybe for yourself or for your family, potentially. All right. Maybe you're feeling like you're not going to get that provider, potentially, here. Some of you guys, it's about being too overly bearing. The emperor, right? A challenge. He's a take charge individual, guys. This is a love reading. There's no love here, okay? So some of you guys, the challenge is just about that go, 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 go energy. And there's not a stop, right? We don't stop to kind of, you know, rejuvenate the relationship. We don't stop to kind of look at the good. We don't stop to kind of smell the flowers. Maybe we don't bring any roses, okay? Maybe the challenge is people really kind of partnering or maybe even kind of communicating here. Building on a solid foundation from the ground up up here okay yeah some of you guys this is about being too hard being too hard here okay others of you guys it's about you know the challenge or the theorist you know not having enough confidence right not having that confidence to be able to go ahead and move forward here okay some of you guys feel like you're not going to get it all right so what's the advice from spirit though guys seven of cups guys with the moon card this is for me guys i really feel like this is all about kind of seeing something clearly all right um not being stuck in your own thoughts here because the seven of cups is confusion right with the moon card that's confusion here i feel like there's a need to kind of really kind of see something clearly see something for what it is take a step back here okay look at this one cup that the fairy is bringing to you right here okay self-love or maybe this is a renewal in love focus on the love instead of focusing on everything else that's you know not bringing any type of love to your life or to your connection here okay for me some of you guys or for for some of you guys it's about you know dreaming again here all right releasing something on this full moon releasing the old here and maybe kind of doing a self-reflection taking a taking a look in the mirror guys here okay because you guys in all these pictures there's a lot of people with their eyes closed here, okay? Seven of Cups, guys. Yeah, this is a fantasy. This is a dream. Um, okay, so for some of you guys, it's a dream that you're wanting. And I feel like they're, the message here is to continue to believe in the dream. Trust the process here, okay? Don't self-sabotage, all right? Have a little, a little bit of faith. Have a little bit of faith, you guys, all right? Others of you guys, this is all about you kind of really seeing something for what it is and not being stuck in a dreamland if it's not for your highest good, guys, okay? All right, what else, Spirit? Three of Pentacles? Yeah, some of you guys, this could have been like um a partnership where you know somebody somebody was like maybe kind of not telling the truth here sleeping with the enemy here okay not keeping them real you guys i'm not gonna do all these this is too many cards that want to jump on we're not gonna do all that but at the top we have better our friends here somebody wants this connection more than the other guys right some of you guys got to bring friendship into the connection right that ace of cups there's no love here right this is a love reading so this is about bringing some love into the connection having some fun here all right maybe for some of you guys the feelings aren't mutual all right somebody's not really ready for the next level Okay, and for some of you guys, don't try to fix what's not broken, right? That's, you know, in your head a little bit too much, right? Thinking about worst case scenario. Others of, others of you guys, consider your options, right? Seven of Swords, doing things differently here, okay? Truth is, guys, incoming or outcoming or outgoing communication is needed here. Heart-to-heart -heart conversations and need for people to really kind of be real with themselves, be real in the connection, all right? Or send that communication, all right? Somebody's missing you. Confessions here. Um, but there also is a need to be honest with yourself, guys, okay? Somebody still wants you. I want you back. I really do want you guys, right? So some of you guys, you could be thinking about somebody really tough or somebody's thinking about you really tough, guys. And maybe somebody's kind of, you know, hiding their feelings, right somebody's like yeah the way this moon card this could be a pisces um but it's like the way this moon card is looking at this three of pentacles it's like you know what this could be us working together building from the ground up here but nobody's speaking somebody's not speaking here right all i want is to be held all i want is something that's committed something that's going to be somebody who's going to be faithful right somebody who's maybe going to put in the work the equal give and take here that's what i want 
All right, that's too many square. We're not going to do all that. But the one that came out on top here was not keeping it real here. All right, somebody's hiding the truth and hiding their true feelings, okay? Um, somebody's ignoring the facts. Somebody's not seeing something clearly, okay? Somebody's not keeping it real with themselves. All right, one way towards you, but maybe a different mindset when they're around others, guys, okay? You guys, yeah, because this divine masculine, he's a divine masculine, right? And he is in a warm, fuzzy place. Like, you know, he's the ruler of the land. I get whatever I want here. But then the right to the left of him is the five of pentacles, a woman and a child. They're left out in the cold here. So maybe somebody's working so hard on their emperor that they're really kind of forgetting about their family, right? Um, somebody's feeling a little bit left out here, okay? It's like we, we have all these pentacles, but where's my boo thing at, right? Okay. Um, others of you guys, though, this is just somebody who maybe kind of was just, you know, selling dreams, okay? What else, spirit? Drinking into the bottle, guys. All right, guys, let's see. What else do we have? What else for our Gemini? Let's go. Deep, guys <laughs> all right um star wants to come out it's, it's trying to come out in reverse though guys okay um we're not gonna do all these there's so many messages guys singles at the bottom of the deck though so i don't read reversals guys but it wants to come out in reverse here your your um your hopes position is the five of pentacles and that's all about being optimistic and having faith here okay all right so star guys some of you guys spirituality right maybe kind of reaching out to somebody a healer a teacher or spiritual all right, um, seeing you as a star, right? Somebody could be seeing you as a star. It could be a dream come true, but somebody's kind of thinking about worst case scenario. Somebody doesn't see that even within themselves here, guys. That's deep. All right, having faith, being optimistic, dreams are coming true, right? You might not be able to see it, guys, right? But this is, you know, your dream. You can't see it, guys, but I feel like somebody is maybe kind of doing something behind the scenes. It could be good. It also could be bad for some of you guys, okay? Um, but this is a renewal, healing, restoring of something, okay? Being balanced, being gentle, and being complete within yourself, within this connection. And once again, wishes are coming true here, okay? But some of you guys are needing to kind of heal. What is this? All right, commitment, marriage plays a factor here, guys. That's the overall energy, right? So as you guys could be separating, could be planning, or you could be already committed here, all right? Um, somebody could be, you know, a third party in a marriage, guys, all right? But people are wanting something serious here, okay? I want something that's faithful, somebody who's faithful. I want somebody who's loyal here, okay? Um, putting in the work for the long term, guys. I want somebody who's mature and honest, okay? All right, one more, and that's it, guys. This is it, guys. This is deep. Yeah, you guys are trying to plan your next move here, all right? I want something solid. I want a happy family here. I want a provider, all right? Or I want to be able to provide. Come in, just one more, please. Three of Pentacles. I want recognition. I want recognition, right? Somebody's not getting their recognition, all right? Somebody's sleeping alone at night here, all right? Unable to kick the connection. I already thinking about you, right? So stay on my mind. I can't ignore these feelings. The one that got away here, okay? A new connection, new energy, high school love energy. I feel like that's needed here in this connection, okay? Um, and wanting to grow old with you guys. So like I said, there's a couple stories. There's somebody who is here who's maybe kind of planning a future with somebody because they see them as their dream come true, guys, right? You see somebody as a dream come true. They see you as a dream come true. And you guys are trying to plan together here, right? Something committed for the long term, all right? Um, others of you guys, I feel like there may be a need to kind of really stay committed and put in the work on yourself here, right? And bring those shadow sides, right? This is the full moon in Pisces, guys, okay? So even if it's not a Pisces, Pisces is all about going with the flow. Pisces is all about emotions, all right? So really kind of getting deep and getting real here, all right? And letting those emotions come to the surface so that you can go ahead and address them and move on here, okay? Seven of Cups, guys. This is to dream and be optimistic, but it also is to not be in denial, guys, okay? Don't be in denial um, and really kind of, ex you know, express express your feelings and face the facts and see the truth of the matter, guys, okay? All right, you guys. So anything else, Spirit? Marvin's rule, right? Yeah.
all right guys so this is i think that's a, this is pretty much it guys this is it gemini i love you guys all right so as always guys if you want to book a personal reading hop over to my website i got a special going on right now but talk to your girl i'll talk back y'all